So if you play jumps or any courses that uh, have got a lot of trees, you're going to find yourself you know, off the fairway, reasonable amount of the times. You see I've got some low hanging branches that I need to keep that ball under and get down the fairway. So a common mistake I often see is either picking the wrong club or adding loft to a club that we don't need. So if I just, if you just kind of think oh, I can chip it out of the wedge, and yeah, you've got the right idea, you're trying to chip it back in the fairway, it's going to go too high, miss the branch that way, but we want to keep it down low. So the other thing I see is people do hit the right club, maybe a seven or eight line, but there again, they're adding loft by you know using the hands too much and adding loft to the club. You know, if we really want to keep this low, we need to keep the handle forward. We need to increase that angle into the ball so we can keep the loft of the club. We don't want that right hand coming in, flicking it up in the air. So I'm going to get the ball in the middle. I'll back my stance. It's quite a short swing. I can be quite aggressive as long as I'm keeping that handle forward like that and keeping that left arm on the shaft in a straight line. What I don't want to do is add unnecessary loft and hit it straight into the tree. So ball middle or back in a stance and try and keep that loft off the club and you can see it's going to go really low hopefully get running back on the fairway so practice that next time in the trees keep that handle forward maybe ball a little bit back maybe get mid iron six or seven iron and just see if you can take all that loft off the club by finishing this sort of angle not flicking it up into trees like that hopefully it helps you out if you need a lesson give us a call today and we'll get you booked in